So we are back in Northern Ireland right now, guys. And in this week's video, we're gonna be bringing you along to a couple of spots that we think are the unsung heroes of this country. We have so many happy childhood memories here. We're really excited to bring you guys along and see if it's as good as we remember. Does it live up to our childhood hype? So far, childhood's great. <laughs> <laughs> or is it kind of crap? Your childhood was a lie. What is this? I'm really hoping it's gonna be good. Good morning guys. Last week we told you that we were going to go to the Wicklow Mountains but we were enjoying the Copper Coast so much that we ran out of time and we had to come back up north to go to our friend's wedding and now we're somewhere else. <laughs> we're somewhere else? <laughs> okay. Great information. Normally our videos are all about like first impressions and we're all exploring places together but we're actually, as Philly said, somewhere else. We're somewhere else. And this week is gonna be all about like re-impressions, yeah? Whatever that means. Uh, I need coffee before I can elaborate on what that means. Okay. Okay, one-handed coffee montage. Wow. I know, right? <laughs> um, this looked different in my hand. Oh my sweet heavenly mercy. I can do it. I can't do the other bit. <laughs> Guys, I swear to you, it has been a heat wave in Northern Ireland. It just seems that every time we put the camera on, the clouds come in. Oh, she is beautiful, even moody. You talking about yourself? <laughs> So we're currently parked up in a little harbour on the east coast and I think our first stop is a wild swim. Is it? It's not. Okay. I, I was expecting <laughs> it to be a bit, a bit sunnier. Guys, honestly, it's meant to be so hot today. Let's go to Bloody Bridge. I mean, it sounds a lot more gruesome than it is. <laughs> we're here. No one else is. <laughs> Okay, so this place is called Bloody Bridge and that is because there is a rebellion that happened in the 1600s. Apparently the rebellion captured some prisoners and they set up a prison exchange but then they got word that the people that they were going to pick up had been killed. So they just got them all the prisoners out here and executed them. Okay, so Bloody Bridge is part of the Morn Coastal Path. It is like a swimming hole. Whenever I was a kid, we came here a lot and it always took a long time to psych ourselves up to finally jump in. But then when we did, we thought it was awesome. So I'm kind of hoping that that's still the same situation. Guys, I tell you what. Tell me what. That looks very bitter. This is the bloody bridge. Where all the blood flowed from the rebellious corpses. Dark. <laughs> Guys, I have major pre-regret. Why? I don't want to swim. Shush, we do want to swim. I've, is is pre a thing? <laughs> it is now. Here it is. Whoa! Billy, it looks just as sick as when I was a kid. <laughs> it's so clear. Billy, it's so deep and it's so clear. Oh my word, I'm actually so excited to get in now. Oh my word, guys, it looks so good. I kind of half expected it to be all dried up because it hasn't rained here in what feels like two years, but it's actually pretty full. Do you have any last words? Guys, I'm going to be honest, on a uh, first re-impression of childhood is a roaring success because I literally cannot wait to get in. I don't even care how cold it is. The nostalgia vibes are real right now. Yeah. Oh, right, I just, let's go. I'm excited. Regret? <laughs> Come alive for a second! Ah! Oh, oh my goodness! <laughs> oh, oh. I feel incredible! Ah! <laughs> I feel alive! The 
this is just as good as childhood. Regret a swim, but you never regret a swim. Never. It's so good. Woohoo! You alright? I honestly like I just don't even feel cold. I just feel numb. So alive. I feel so alive right now. Let's go do some more fun stuff. Yay! So far childhood's great! <laughs> <laughs> I see a lot of seaweed down there and as you know I've said I'm keen about seaweed people told me dulse is edible so I've looked it up I'm gonna go see if any of that is dulse because if so I mean I'm gonna eat it <laughs> on your own no you're gonna eat it too 12 seconds later Keely you okay are you sure and what happened <laughs> Are you sure you're okay? I did so good at saving myself, I could have broke so many things! <laughs> Kaylee! I Flippin' really, heck! I really fell so far! I know! I really could have hurt myself so much! You could have smashed your face on a rock in your hand! All in pursuit of seaweed! <laughs> Guys, I need to wrap this girl in bubble wrap! <laughs> Seriously, this happens way too often! Honestly, really, I saw I can't describe how much of a miracle it is I didn't hurt myself. Keely. I fell so far. You just need to go back to the van. <laughs> no one needs seaweed. It needs to be for something. I don't know if I can trust you to get seaweed. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> how are you still alive? Just like Bambi. Oh yeah, it's the wrong type of seaweed. It's that one that looks like testicles. Alright, let's get this one back to the van. Get her seatbelt on before she injures herself or anyone else for that matter. Get yourself in a body of water. Honestly, you, you won't regret it. Yes. You might pre-regret it, but you won't regret it. <laughs> right, breakfast please. Left hand. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Ah. Hi. Hi, Captain. I'm excited. What are we doing? Why are you excited? Okay, one, I feel great after swimming and breakfast. And two, we're going to go do something that I did every time I came to Newcastle as a kid. So I'm excited about that. Okay, guys, the rules are we both get a pound and whoever comes back with the most money is the winner. <laughs> yeah. Okay, but you can only spend the pound. Yeah, you only get one pound. Gambling, not good, guys. Only spend what you can afford to lose. And I think we can maybe just about afford one pound. <laughs> Each. Yeah? <laughs> Let's spend all at once. So that's what you can spend. Okay. This is what we count at the end. The loser makes coffee for a week. Okay, yeah, I'm all right. up for that. We're in. We're on. You lose. I'm already just a big fat loser. Oh my goodness, Billy, my money's not doing anything. Oh my goodness. Guys, I'm not forgetting. Show me this. your profit. I'm doing like the double whammy. Oh my goodness, you already won. Got the tickets? This is so unfair. <laughs> Ready? Oh guys, this is so embarrassing. <laughs> In my childhood, I feel like I won a lot. <laughs> I'm not a winner now. Philly, Philly, Philly. I haven't won anything. <laughs> I won something! You won? I won 10p. That's a 90% loss. <laughs> I am a winner. I mean, we're both losers here. <laughs> Let's be realistic. You're finished? Count your profit. I'm finished. I'm finished. 38p. The only way I can beat you is if I go big 
on the Tempe machines. Okay, let's do this. This is going to bring me to glory. This one's, this one's my redemption. Oh, Philly, I actually feel really sorry for you. This would be the worst experience of an arcade as a child ever. Yeah, this, this was my experience as a child. Yeah. Guys, we do this so you don't have to. These are scam. <laughs> I don't know what he's talking about. I spent one pound and got 38 p. Okay, guys, um, I spent all my winnings. And... I feel like we lost so much time in there. Yeah. Is it the next day? <laughs> I spent it all and gained nothing except for this this thing worth <laughs> 10 points and we give all our tickets to a kid. So technically we're both losers, so Kaylee's still going to make the coffee. No, I am not. I have this token to prove oh. I'm the winner forever. Every week, no. every night, every day of this week you're making <laughs> me no, I'll friggin' <laughs> swallow it and get it out of my poop. All right, guys. Next stop on our list is Castle Wellen Forest Park. I haven't been to it in literal decades, mm -hmm. so I'm interested to see if it lives up to my childhood hype. So far, my childhood has well lived up to its hype, apart from the fact that I'm obviously a bigger loser as an adult. But uh, I'm excited to go see your childhood. We're all bigger losers as adults. <laughs> Let's do this! Hello. So Castle Wellen was actually where I got my first bicycle. Aww. It was a hand-me-down of my sister's and it was a pink bike that like overnight my dad went out and got blue spray paint and sprayed it blue. And I woke up in the morning with this blue, like this cool new like, blue bike. <laughs> so cool. Guys, honestly, I am so excited. This is this brings back so many memories. It may be called Castle Wellen, but I did not know there was going to be a castle. There's a castle. Castle Wellen Castle. Hello, do I pay here for the car park? You can pay here, um, yes, there's five for the day or 25 for the year. This will be yearly pass. So. That's cool, awesome. Thank awesome. you so much. Thank you that. so much. You get a wee map and all and a wee. He was so nice. He was so friendly. Are you ready? Are you ready? <laughs> Stretching. I'm gonna win this one. All right, Beverly, are you ready for this? Um, I just had my coffee. I had a cereal bar to get my energy up. So I'm ready to beat your ass. Yeah, is this fight and talk? Yeah. Let's do it. Ow, my God. I'm delicate. <laughs> Guys, this is it. The challenge of all challenges. Winner takes a month of coffee in the morning. Yeah, but I've yeah. already won a little. So if you win, I do it for one week. And if I win, you do it for a month. Okay. Okay. See ya. <laughs> oh, no, no. Apparently it's three and a half kilometers long. No, if you get lost. I wasn't prepared for that. I was thinking 10 minutes. <laughs> there you go. Most people complete the challenge in 40 minutes. That's quite long. <laughs> Isn't it? All right, guys, this is it. We're ready to go. Are you, are you ready? Yeah. Okay. We're just going to count down. Are we racing? Yes, we're racing. Okay. Three, Three, two, one, go. bye. <laughs> I don't really have a strategy. My strategy is just to be faster than Keely. So that shouldn't be too hard because she's got tiny legs. Okay guys, I'm not gonna lie. I can totally cheat and use the drone, but I'm gonna put it away. I'm gonna win fair and square. All right, so I just came up on this bridge. Gives me a good vantage point. Can't see Keely though. Let's keep moving. We can do this. We can do this. Yeah. Okay. I've no idea where I'm going. Um. I'm going that way. Guys, it's been about two hours. Starting to get a little bit thirsty. Getting hungry. Didn't bring any water. Uh, I don't know if I'll make it. Goodness. Oh my goodness, am I a champion of some sort? I'm on a bridge. You're gonna lose? I'm not. Sucker. I'm on a bridge. You better not cheat. You're only crying like a loser. she's all barking, go bite. She can, she can give it, but can she take it? We're about to find out. Right, that's enough of that bridge banter. It's time to get serious. And uh, I had a goal. I was just gonna turn left the whole time. And my theory was that would eventually get me to the middle. But I kind of lost track of that, and I don't know where I am. I'm so close. 
I think I might have, I think I actually might be at the end. See if Kaylee's up here. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me? I don't know why I got here you cheated. before you. You cheated. I can't believe that. There's no way. Billy, I got here and I didn't even use the drone. I'm devastated. I did this all by myself. Billy, I'm a genius. I'm a loser. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold the phone. Guys, I've just discovered something so heinous and so terrible that frankly is unforgivable. Let's just rewind this shot a little bit. Okay, so if we take a look at this drone shot, you can see Keely uh, running around the maze. Oh, and uh, what, what's Keely doing? She's going through the hedge. She told me she went through the hedge, but she promised me that she came out the way she came in. But if we look deeper, come with me. In fact, she does not go through the same hedge. She goes round and out the other side and up the hill to claim her pseudo victory. What is this? Guys, and the plot thickens. If we also go back, you can see me. I go and I see the hole in the hedge. And do I cheat? No, I take the moral high ground. I go back and I find my way fair and square. What do you have to say for yourself? I genuinely thought I no. went back out the hole. These lies fall on deaf ears. <laughs> now that we all know the truth, let's get back to the video. Okay guys, so after the excitement of my victory, Shut up. Um, <laughs> we're gonna go for a walk around Castle Well and Lake. It's like an hour loop, so we're gonna go enjoy that. So there's a couple of things that I remember about the lakes. One is, I feel like in my memory, there's a big wooden dinosaur. Okay, I'm Somewhere intrigued. like up in the trees. And there's also a big wooden chair, like okay. a giant's chair. This is in my memory from like decades ago. So I'm interested to see if, if, they're, still here. if they're still here or if I'm just doubting. Doubting? Doubting. It almost feels like we're in Canada or something. I was going to say Canada. I was just looking out when I had the drone up on all the dense trees. And I was like, this is way better than a normal lake walk that I was expecting. This is very rich in wildlife and very diverse trees and feels very wild. Should I have fiber to park? Um, this is win, win, win for me right now. I know it's nice that it's not like 13.50 per person to park. <laughs> Um, if you didn't watch it, Philly's complaining about the Giants Causeway, go watch it here. <laughs> okay, so we couldn't find the chair. I know. I must have missed it, but if I can't find this dinosaur, I've been living a lie. <laughs> Five minutes later. So it turns out dinosaurs are extinct. Oh, really? I should have known. So the dinosaur and the chair are both gone? My life is a lie. Your childhood was a lie. What is this? Did you make them up or were they imaginary? No, I am going to go onto Google right now <laughs> and find images and pop them up. Oh, maybe your family were just humouring you and they were never <laughs> really there. It was all in my head. <laughs> what a treat. Oh, Philly, this looks like so much effort. You don't have to like put your lips around it and blow. Are you doing it? Do you have a foot pump or something or how do you do it? I have a pump. Right, I'll leave you to that because I'm sorry to tell you Philly but that looks like a pump that you have to do yourself. I don't think that's electric. It's in the front of the van. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> How excited are you right now on a scale of one to two? <laughs> two. I'm quite impressed how quickly they blew up. That their pump thing's a right job, isn't it? I thought it was going to be like 20 minute job. It was, it was like two like, minutes. It was like 90 seconds. Yeah. Let's go paddleboarding. It's heavier than I thought it would be. It's huge. I bet I still fall off it. You fall off it many times, you'll still be on it. <laughs> psych myself up for this because I really don't want to do it. <laughs> Guys, I thought I would. I thought it'd be fun. Everyone says it's fun, but I'm going to be honest. I just know I'm going to fall in. He knows I'm going to fall in. He's laughing at me already. 
He says you're quackers. And <laughs> I just can't be bothered. I see when I fall in, it's gonna put me in a real bad mood. I'm not even sure a curry chip will be able to bring me round from it, I'm being honest. Put your armband on and shut up. Okay, yeah. okay, let's go. Tangleweed and die. Can you be a bit more positive, please? Sorry. I just have a real bad feeling I'm gonna fall in. <laughs> then watch, you know? watch your fin. Like, I don't know why, but I would rather be on a surfboard in six foot waves, getting smashed to death, than fall off a paddleboard in a placid lake. Give me my pole. <laughs> I'm not about this. You go girl, look at you. You go girl. <laughs> you look like you're having a blast. There you go. Good luck. See you on the other side. We've never seen her again. I haven't quite managed to stand up properly. I can stand up, but I can't stand up and paddle. This is... <gasps> Look, I'm standing and I'm paddling. I can do it. <sighs> I live to fight another day. Gliding through the water there. Did you see that? Yeah. You see me glide? You and gli he like be fish. gliding. That's like a fish in water. <laughs> That's what they call me. How awesome is this setting? Yeah, it's so beautiful. Incredible. It's actually kind of fun. And it's actually quite beautiful. And they didn't take as long to pump up as I thought. They that my I had that roll down in like three minutes. So maybe they're not as awkward as I thought and not as scary as I thought. Hmm. So I'll I'll eat my own words. Paddleboard was quite fun. Only because I didn't fall off. If I fell off, this would be a totally different <laughs> story. <laughs> Thank you, Casawell, and you have been marvellous. Onwards. Yeah. Okay, guys, we're back at Newcastle. We're here to get a curry chip. I've sent Philly off. I'm going to clean the van because the van's a bit of a mess. But this is one of the final things that I'm going to see if it lives up to my childhood hype. Northern Ireland does a good flipping chippy. But this chippy at the top of town in Newcastle, in my memory, has the best onion rings I've ever had in my entire life. No other onion ring has ever compared in my life. So, they better be friggin' good. Van is definitely just a bit messy right now. Chips! Well, it's nice, lovely. <laughs> I feel like we're on a date. <laughs> it's like old times. Show us. Get the yes. chips out. Let's see if they're if they're good or bad. If they're as you remember. Well. Okay. Oh my word, I feel like my mouth is filled with saliva of anticipation. I told everyone these were the best onion rings in my life. You need to do uh, a naked taste. You can't catch up at first. You have to get the full okay. raw taste. Okay. Oh my word, there's so much hype right now. Are you ready? Play that sexy music. I'll give it to them. They're bloody good. <laughs> they are like that's a that's a feast. Look how meaty that onion ring is. You've got a thick ring. Oh yeah. I'm really happy with that. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> what is that? Peas and onions on a curry chip. This is everything, man. I I've just had the best day ever. Guys, what a fantastic day. Yeah, I've had a great day. Honestly, this has just been really lovely and chill. It's just been like a full-on day. I love making videos with you. It's just like every day is a date day. <laughs> How nice is that? Yeah, so nice. I mean, some days I want to strangle you, but... Yeah, you do. <laughs> but some days it's just nice. 
But this has made me really appreciate like where I've grew up and I'm I'm interested guys. Where do you have like really good childhood memories of? I want you to tell me in the comments and then I want you guys to go back. If it's close to where you are, go back, re-experience it, tell us if it lives up to the hype. Maybe we're just really lucky that all these places have been awesome. Um so yeah, tell us where's your childhood place and it'll help us know where you all are because we don't even know where happy you live so it'd be a really nice way to yeah. connect, wouldn't it? I would like that, that would be cool. Guys, I've just taken some gorgeous little drone shots of us driving out through Newcastle and the drone got dive bombed by a seagull and then he stalked the drone the whole way back to the van like a madman I'm well, in he shock wanted to, he wanted a mate with the drone <laughs> I'm not weird <laughs> drone birds coming to kill you honestly <laughs> seagulls <laughs> <sighs> alright team what a day this has been I know right I'm pretty sure I can feel my forehead so tight from the sun, sun being sun and I see you, you're sun kissed as well, you little tomato. And the more important thing I see is that, uh, um, if we all remember, I was the one. <laughs> I was I'm, the nobody remembers, I was nobody the remembers. I actually deleted it from the video. I, I didn't actually, we didn't actually go. I was I the winner. I don't know what you're talking about. I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> at least I won the hedge maze. I won the hedge maze. Shut up. Okay, <laughs> but at least you didn't fall over and <laughs> face plant a rock. <laughs> The Rock, per, per Dwayne. Oh, guys, what am I like? Guys, it's been a chock a day, and yes. Keely was gonna make buns, but you know what? I don't think we've got it in us. I don't think we've got it. I was also gonna go forage for seaweed here, um, but I think I'll maybe maybe give myself a rest on the seaweed today. Maybe go forage tomorrow. Mhm. Mm I think so. I think so. So we're gonna unwind, have a cup of tea, chill out for a bit, and go to sleep. Yeah. We'll catch you guys in the morning. Love yous. Love you. Good morning guys. This is the kind of morning that we were after for yesterday. It is an absolute cracker and considering I lost pretty much everything yesterday, I am on coffee duty. Thanks honey. Love you. Cheers. Look, in my books, I was a winner when I married you. Oh, sheesh yourself! <laughs> <laughs> so we're both winners here, right? Yeah. <laughs> so obviously Keely's off foraging for seaweed. Hopefully she doesn't face plant and slither down into a rock this time. I don't think this is it either. I think this is too curly. This might be it, but probably both not edible. There you go, guys. I suppose we don't give Northern Ireland enough credit. Yeah, we definitely don't. When the sun's out, it is beautiful. Uh-huh. And that little trip down memory lane's been lovely, hasn't it? Oh, it's been great. Remember to put in the comments the place that you used to go to as a kid and we can reminisce together. Yeah, that'd be nice. That would be fun. If you want to see more of Northern Ireland, go check out our other videos we've done here. And if you really want to cringe, you can go back and check our old videos from when yeah, we first don't started do that, YouTube. Don't do that, don't do that. <laughs> Any videos that's like a year old, that's about as far back as you should go. <laughs> anyway, guys, thanks for hanging out. Yeah, we love you guys. Thanks for watching. I will see you next week. Bye. Bye.